Right. Good morning. Uh, my name is Angelo and I am the country manager for Philippines and uh, Vietnam or for Southeast Asia, basically for Trent University Tech's campus. So I am recording this presentation to discuss or to explain to you why Trent University is a good opportunity or good school for you to study in Canada. Right. So I'm going to be running through the slides a bit and play a few videos. So hopefully if uh, you choose to decide to work with Trent University, you can sign up with any of our partner accredited agencies or let me know should you want should should you wish to push through. This uh, presentation will be targeted towards the students. Um, where in the partner agents who will also be uh, watching this can use this presentation to play in their offices or to their inquiries. All right, welcome to Trent University. Basically, the Trent University I'll be presenting is the one located in uh, Oshawa. Uh, Trent University has three campuses. One is in Peterborough. The other one is in Durham in Oshawa as well. But what I'll be presenting is the new campus, specifically four minutes away from our main Oshawa campus. The name of the university will be Trent Tech's Campus. All right. Let me uh, briefly inform you um, what Trent University is all about. Um, Trent University has been known in Ontario as the number one undergraduate university. We provide personal, purposeful, and transformative um, approach in terms of teaching you we provide um, a way to make it experiential in, uh, go in the goal of uh, providing you an opportunity to transition to eventual work and possibly migration. So that is Trent University Challenge the Way You Think. That is our motto for the whole university system. Right, so why choose Trent University? Um, again, I'll be explaining Trent University in the perspective of a student who wants to enroll in, uh, in our institution. Okay. All right. A quick run through why Canada is a, is a good destination, um, I would say, in the Philippine market. Currently, we are number one in terms of the preferred destination, mainly because of the fast and very obvious detailed migration process. So for our uh, brothers and sisters in other parts of Southeast Asia, for Vietnam, Indonesia, Malaysia, and other parts of Southeast Asia, this is, uh, Canada is very, very good in terms of uh, bringing your family to Canada for migration purposes to give better benefits in terms of health and education background. Trent University, ranking-wise, has been known as number one in Ontario, as previously mentioned, for 12 years in a row in terms of undergraduate programs. Reputation-wise, we are number one and number two all over Canada, and number two in terms of innovation. 
In terms of support for students, we are very much known for our for an education institution. Again, we are a university, but we provide number one in terms of scholarships and bursaries, and number two in student services. We are very competitive in terms of providing providing international scholarships and awards. And because of the support that we provide to the students, 95% of our students would choose um, Trent all over again. They're very, very much ha happy. And 94% are satisfied with the overall quality of education. Right? This is a, a quick testimonial video from one of our students from Malaysia. Right? I will not play this one. But should you choose to watch this video, just let me know and I can send you the actual link of the file. It's quite big, so that's why I'm making this recording for everyone. My name is Joshua Lau. Right. Just going to skip this one as well. Hi. Right. I think this is very important for our Southeast Asia family to remember, right? As I mentioned a while ago, 94, 95% of our students who study at Trent is very, very happy with the service and the quality of education. This part, um, emphasizes that uh, trivia as well. 93% of our graduates are employed within six months after studying in Trent University. Because as mentioned in the previous slides that our method of teaching is all about 100% guaranteed experiential learning. Once our students graduate, it's very important to see the companies that are shown here. Given a university, the companies that we work with or our linkages are multinational companies like Honda, Coca-Cola, Sun Life, eBay, Pepsi, Air Canada, and so on, even Google. So once they graduate from Trent, they, are, they have an opportunity to work with these companies and find job, okay? Right, since we are also number, I think number two in terms of innovation all over Canada, we can guarantee you that um, our programming are new and relevant. Our equipments are state of the art. Our faculty are very much award winning. All right. And um, everything is all about innovation. Statistically speaking, here are our current top five countries. Hence, I, I am um, honored to be given the task to market or provide support for the Southeast Asia market. We are hoping to grow the numbers of Southeast Asian students to study at Trent University, specifically in Tech's campus. Right, this slide shows you the award-winning alumnus or alumni of uh, Trent University. And let me just emphasize on this part of the slide, all right? Again, remembering that should you be studying in Trent, this discussion is all about Trent University Tech's campus, okay? But if ever you want, you have students who will be studying in Peterborough or in the Durham GTA main campus, just let me know and I can make an endorsement to my colleague who handles it, all right? But for my presentation, again, this is for Tech's campus, which is also located in Durham GTA, all right? Here you go. Quick trivia about our location. Our location for the Trent Tech campus is in Oshawa, known as one of the fastest growing city in Canada. Take note, Oshawa. It is the gateway to the most popular or populous region of Canada. Ranking wise, top seven intelligent community, top five manufacturing cluster, and it is the top region for millennial migration to Canada. Right. This exact building is the new campus that we are building located again in Oshawa. This is the exact building that will be located for Trent Tech's campus, right? This is the home for mostly postgraduate certificate programs and ESL, right? Let me just skip this one. Um, Trent University is in partnership with Edvoy, but you don't need to worry about that. Um, just remember, take note that once the student graduates from our Tech's campus, the diploma and everything will be under Trent. Edvoy only provides support in terms of faster admissions process. So that is one of the unique selling point for studying at our Tech campus. It is managed by a private company to make sure that the support in terms of providing scholarships, discounts and admissions processes are a bit more faster. Right, and this is the exact address. Um, Oshawa is 40 minutes away going to Toronto. So very, very nearby. If you have students who are having a hard time maybe or not sure if they want to go to Toronto or something more manageable, um, they can consider Oshawa. Right? Okay. 
Our intakes for the text programs are every January, May, and September. Those are the main intakes. So let me run through with some of the programs. Um, for Filipinos, the ESL and Pathway program is not um, appropriate with a background, given Filipinos applicants does not require IELTS for application, right? But uh, of course, for our other brothers and sisters from Southeast Asia, let me discuss the ESL and Pathway programs briefly, right? Okay, so for Vietnam, Malaysia, Indonesia, um, Singapore, or our other uh, brothers and sisters of Southeast Asia, we do require IELTS for your application. But should they wish not to take IELTS, they can enter the program via the ESL program, which is a language pathway to undergraduate programs. Um, the duration the duration for the programs is uh, differs in duration so it can be short term it can be long term depending on the goal of the student right and after studying for the ESL program that's the time that they can take any programs from all our Trent University campuses okay for the text campus which I'm mainly handling the minimum requirement after ESL is that they should be able to have finished a bachelor's degree in their home country okay um, however, if they did not finish a bachelor's degree after EHL, they can take a bachelor's program from Trent University in Peterborough. Okay, here you go. So uh, for the ESL program, again, there's no minimum provisions to require. They can just enroll anytime that they want. So just let me know on, the, on uh, when the student would like to apply. Okay, and for the pathway program, here you go. So Trent's uniquely accredited ESL program allows students to take advantage of a full experience and gain, gain credit toward undergraduate degrees, right? So if they're admitted to Trent and the proficiency does not meet, that is where the pathway comes in, all right? So going back again for the ESL, either they can take the pure ESL program or they can continue to a pathway program to Trent University in Peterborough in, or in our main Durham campus, not the Tex campus, okay? Here we go. Okay, so when can the student transition to the pathway program? As soon as they meet the minimum grade requirement for the placement test. So if they reach a total or overall IELTS test of 5.0 or up to 6.5, that's the time they can transition to a pathway program. Okay. And for the ESL um, class schedule, it is usually fixed, and this is how it usually looks like. For the text campus program, I'm not certain how it works yet, but the standard is usually three hours per day, then three to four days a week. Okay, It can be finalized upon enrollment. Right. And focusing now on our main programs for the text campus, this is for everyone. Um, this is the postgraduate certificate. Again, the minimum requirement for everyone is that they should have finished a bachelor's degree level. So you will be submitting the college diploma, college transcript. Um, for the high school or secondary diploma and transcript, we'll have to verify that one, but better if you can prepare that as well. Then, of course, your passport, then um, the English certificate for other countries except for Filipinos, Filipinos, you do not need to submit an IELTS certificate. You only need to submit the medium of instruction. Here are our programs for the postgraduate um, certificate courses. Okay. So I'm going to run through on this a few more. But uh, just to inform you, um, before I discuss the main programs, coming soon, Hopefully soonest, we're gonna be we're gonna be launching this specific certificate courses. Um, I'm very much happy with health leadership and management because we have been receiving a lot of applications from nurse profession nursing professionals, so they can definitely take these courses. Anyway, before I specify the the courses itself, I'd like you to observe that most of the programs offered at Tex Campus are business related. However, the business programs are not very one sided. It's very much um, niche and versatile. So for example, you have a student who graduated with an engineering background. They can still take this program. In a nutshell, anyone who has a bachelor's degree can take any of our courses because all our courses are very much versatile and can be easily defended in their statement of purpose. Because I am certain that most of the courses do have some management experience 
at the same time, right? So programs and business come, finance, human resource, marketing, and accounting, okay? So this is the good thing about Trent University. You can choose any program at a university study level and a postgraduate level as well. Okay. All right. Let me run through some of our active programs right now. We are still accepting applications for the month of September 2023. Um, and uh, we can, let me check. We can also start getting applications for January, May, and September 2024. All right. Okay. So we have the postgrad certificate in human resource management. This postgrad certificate is for one year. Um, it's open for January, May, and September. Same one-year program for marketing and entrepreneurship, financial analytics, but it's only open for every September. Let me just move this one. Oh, yeah, there you go. And postgrad certificate in business communications. Um, intake is also every May and September. And, however, if you have a student who wishes to study for a full two-year program, mainly because they want a PGWP that's good for up to three years, okay? So that we have a few bundled courses or a dual certificate program. So this is one of them, a dual certificate program for human resource marketing and entrepreneurship. So this is two years direct study and a dual certificate for business communication and human resource management, also two years. Deadline for application are shown here. Again, we're accepting applications for as early as September intake, but should you wish to study in 2024, we can also accept your applications as early as now. Even for the ESL program, the, in, the deadlines are shown in your screen. All right. In terms of accommodation for the student, um, Trent University can provide support. If not, you just contact me, let me know, and I can provide you assistance on how to find accommodations via our past students and by our accommodations team in the university. Here you go, just a quick run through. Right, and how much does our program cost? Please focus on the tuition fee. Do not mind the ancillary housing books and personal fees. Those are just estimates to, on to give you an idea on how much you should need to prepare. Um, for the postgraduate certificates, our one year is around 20,208. Take note, all right? The price point for studying in Ontario is ranging from 16 to 22,000 per year. And for a university level study or, and a postgraduate program, our tuition is only 20,000 Canadian dollars. I would say it's very much affordable in terms of those benefits. For our ESL academic fees, it's around 5,000 to 6,000 per level. Okay, again, um, we're talking about levels for ESL. But for um, the whole year, you can see it here on the other side of the screen. Okay, I'm going to skip this part. And I did mention about the multinational companies. Here you go. So once you study at Trent University, we provide a lot of different opportunities and support to our students, especially in terms of counseling for immigration. Most of, our, the, of the agents that we have signed have um, in-house or immigration support as well. But if ever your agency does not have that, don't worry because Trent University has a counseling or free consultation in terms of immigration support, right? Now, let me quickly play a video from Dr. Leo Gork. Uh, this is Trent's president and vice chancellor. Welcome to Trent. I'm Leo Gork, the president of Trent University. On behalf of the university, I'm pleased to welcome you to our dynamic community. As you become an important part of our community, I'd like to share a few of the reasons why, year after year, Trent is named Ontario's number one undergraduate university. One of the reasons I came to Trent is because I believe that we are a university that is the right size, large enough to offer a broad range of programs and experiences, it's small enough to allow close, friendly interactions between students, professors, and staff. The Trent experience is personal. It's personal, purposeful, and transformative. At Trent, our students have the opportunity to learn from faculty members who help them set and accomplish their academic goals. They meet friendly staff who provide academic support. 
They gain hands-on career experience through co-op programs and research opportunities with their professors. Students have two campuses to choose from, our beautiful Peterborough campus on the banks of the Otonabee River and our thriving urban Durham campus in the greater Toronto area. After Trent, our grads have enjoyed success around the world. They include famous authors, important politicians, successful teachers and nurses, doctors, lawyers, digital business leaders, Rhodes Scholars, and Nobel Prize winners. I invite you to discover more about Trent for yourself. When you do come to Trent, I look forward to the opportunity to meet you in person. Don't hesitate to email me if you think the President's Office can be of help. Okay, so that is Trent University for you um, in a nutshell on why you should study Trent, uh, study at Trent University. Let me state a few points. So again, it's a university level of education. Um, all our programs for Trent Tech's campus mostly are all for postgraduate, uh, postgraduate certificate or postgraduate level of studies, making it easier to scale and easier to defend for visa application. It's more progressive, right? So it's pre-masters in terms of studies in Southeast Asia. Um, the, all the programs are versatile. So uh, they can create a niche expertise for each applicant and easy to connect program with any student expertise. Our tuition fee is uh, on average um, since we charge only 20,000 per year, okay? And uh, making the financials worth it. And the deposit to get the letter of acceptance for all countries is only 2,500 Canadian dollars. Make it very, very competitive. And in terms of English requirement for Filipinos, I'm happy to announce that we do not require IELTS. Additionally, um, we do not charge application fee for all our students in all Southeast Asia. Again, no application fee for everyone, right? And lastly, we can issue you the letter of acceptance within two weeks time maximum, right? So hopefully that's clear. So uh, yeah, I look, I look forward to seeing your application at Trent University. And should you have any questions, do not hesitate to let me know. You can always reach me out, right? My contact details, if you can take note, would be via WhatsApp. It's plus six three nine zero five five two seven four two five four, or send me an email at angelo at edvoy.com. That's Angelo at edvoy.com. All right. Thank you very much for your time. And uh, hopefully I can uh, see you soon. I look forward to working with you. Thank you very much.